Swivel, but it comes straight to my rod tip eye and mash up the rod tip eye. Next time, we've got a small air bead there, so we'll butt the bead, the bead will butt there, so and hopefully preventing it from the metal to metal and licking out the eye. But anyhow, we can change it today, so we can change my rod eye today. So if you look good, the rod eye mash up. Can't do nothing with it. If you look good too, as well, it split right there, so. So, this is what we can do today. Change the rod tip. Stay tuned. All right, people. Look, like if we're recording, so first thing to do is we can change. We can try to get off the rod eye. First, we need something to heat the rod eye like a little, a little lighter. And I got my little burr beat pliers. Any burr beat pliers can do. Any lighter. And basically, you heat it up. You can see some smoke. You might hear a little click pops, whatever it is. 
That means that your glue soften up. So, oh, I wanted to see. Heating up, heating up, heating up, heating up, heating up. Make sure, yep, see that big buffer smoke? That means that it heats up enough. And it actually ease off too. See that, see how easy it come off. Drop a layer of sink, cause you know that I would've heated that old glue from in there, so. So now I got to look for a raw tip to match this here. A raw tip to match this here, so no. Um, all right, we stay tuned. We can go inside the layer box. We can find my layer trusty box here, so no. We can look for a raw tip. I'm not talking about raw tip though. Some some people actually come in here so later for a raw tip. That can fit. Um, too bony. Still too bony. Too bony. Too bony. Too bony. Alright, I think I find a big one here. Alright, that drop on it's a too easy, too easy, too easy for me. Too easy for me. I want something just a little more snug. Like this here, so see this is so going snug. But this is my other ice here, so I may have to wrap this here so a little bit. But you don't feel it wrapping it. Alright, let me check and see if my other eyes got it and we can pause and we can get back to this here. All right, cool. So I find a rod tip. See if you look and see it fitting snug and tight. That's what I want. Snug and tight. Um, they got different ways of sticking it on. They got different ways of sticking it on, right? They got the which is the original way. It looked like a glue stick. Um, you take the same lighter, hit the hit like the hot glue glue stick. It, well, it looked like a glue stick, but I don't know if it's a glue stick or not. But then just heat it, drop a little bit on, and then push it on, line it up in position, and then give it about 10 minutes and it glue and hard enough. Right, there's that one way. But I don't got the original one, so we got to use epoxy. So I got a little, um, five minute epoxy you got a minute to play with you got a minute to stir it up then you start to get hard you put it on straighten it out and then when it's straightened out we line it up make sure it line up good then we you know what it is all right cool that body came to me but somebody coming here so so we do this here so fast so as we get this video here so over with fast look so brand new a bit here, so you just need a little bit, you just need a little bit. So, I will just Right, so just need a little bit down and down this side here so i'll spray not too much on that side so this is so we mix this up here so fast mix it up fast mix it up fast mix it up fast and you know it's starting to feel a little sticky sticky ish like so then time we put it on So we got one minute to play with this particular epoxy and then sense it on we then twist it around a little bit make sure that all the glue spinning around inside there and then we line it up so that if we can look straight through this eye and go straight down through all the other eyes so if you look and see, 
if you could look and see straight down through the other eyes. Right. I'm gonna check back and make sure. Like right there. We got a layer excess around the edges. See, it's starting to get sticky there. Let's put on your rod tip. Again, probably you well, this, well, this blue here saw is one minute epoxy. We got one minute of working time. Stir it up, stir it up, stir it up. Got one minute to play with, fix it in place, and then you got four minutes before it will rock solid and you can move it. Uh, if you want to remove it again, you know, use that saw to light up, burn it off, and we go again. So. Everybody now to go back on the boat and go fishing again. Beijing Fish Breakers. Peace. Yeah, man. I can't see in the camera, but hey, look, if you did, I'm still breathing there, McKee. You get her. All right, I tell them the I tell them the that today is prime day for catching fish. Today is prime day for catching fish. We tell them the All right. Yeah, man. Right, the first one, yeah. Gary, second one. Second one here. Still locking at 16 point. Yeah, all right, good. That is zero, zero. All right, this one is 13.69. 13, show me up. 